In this video I'm going to talk about how we developed the show Durable Mike Malloy from its um, the initial uh, concept and source material through um, to the, the, the final script and then the casting. Um, <coughs> Durable Mike Malloy was based on a true story um, that um, I had uh, seen on television and thought was very interesting and then I um, uh, studied about it online and then I told um, uh, Patrick Broderick who um, eventually played the title character of Mike Malloy and he decided that it would be a good idea to make it into a show so um, in our directing classes we would discuss this um, and then we plotted out some ideas for scenes that we could have um, we initially we always wanted it to be a physicalized piece and things like when he when Malloy is knocked down by the cab we always saw that as being very physicalized um, and the bizarre twist of it um, told us we always wanted to be slightly surreal um, Brecht was was mentioned from the start we wanted a Brechtian style and also um, a kind of physicalized Burkhoff performance. We were both um, very interested in uh, Stephen Burkhoff at the time. Um, and as we uh, discussed it, uh, Leo Howes became involved, who was also in our directing class. Um, uh, Leo Howes uh, became the assistant director um, when it was finally decided that I would direct the show. Um, and Leo Howes also played one of the gangsters, Francis Pasqua. Um, <coughs> Uh, we decided to write the piece collaboratively, um, giving each other a few scenes to write and then bringing them all together into one script. So we'd already written ideas of what we wanted to happen in each scene. Uh, the, 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 the knocking down with the cab scene was mentioned from the start. Um, the, uh, obviously the, the, the stages of them trying to kill Michael, my lawyer, so the, the scene where Michael is drinking and not dying, and then when they poison him and he doesn't die. Um, when they uh, try to freeze him to death, when they knock him down with the cab, and then finally shooting him. So we each took a few scenes, um, and then uh, I took the scenes and just formatted them so they were all written um, in the same style, and just changing a few words here and there um, to keep the characters consistent throughout the show, and, and, and things of this nature. Um, we uh, decided early on that um, Paddy was going to play um, Mike Malloy. Uh, I was thinking of playing Anthony Marino and um, uh, Leo was, was going to be um, Francis Pasqua. However, then when we um, auditioned the piece, um, it was decided that that Paddy would would be the main character and wouldn't have a directing role because he had so many lines and such a large part to play in it. I decided that because um, I was wanting to pursue directing at the time, I dropped out of playing a character and just um, had a directing role. Um, Leo chose to be assistant director and still maintained uh, a small part of, of Francis Pasqua so that he could do both. Um, we were lucky enough that we were able to get the uh, college students to audition um, for the the part um, and the majority of them um, had had roles in the show. Uh, we also had Matthew Bingham and Mark Wilson from our own class who, who um, were in it um, and we used the university students to, to try and um, teach the college students because they hadn't done much of physicalization and hadn't done much uh, Brecht or Burkhoff. Um, so we tried to use that as a learning experience for them as well. And then also some smaller characters that came in later on, um, such as the, um, the, the police chief, uh, the doctor and so on, um, they were filled by uh, uh, Gary Davis and Nathan Myers respectively. Um, and then uh, one small part at the end which was left over, I, I filled in myself, I played one of the clerks. Um, 
I'd, I'd wanted just a directing role, but um, at the last minute, and there was still a character that needed filming. Um, uh, so those were um, that was how we uh, developed it, and then we finally had a script, we had a cast, and we were ready to make the show.